Hi everyone. For this demo, I want to show how I can have connectivity between two VCNs in the same region and tenancy using FQD and DNS resolution. To demonstrate this, I have configured two VCNs with DNS domain name enabled for this demo. Each VCN has two subnets with a DNS label. I have one resource in each subnet with an FQDN formed from the VCN domain name, subnet label, and the host name. Before making any changes, I verify the response of all host FQDN using NS lookup. I am using a compute host in the Phoenix DNS demo VCN for this. The first two DNS queries will be for the host in the same VCN, the compute and the DB host. The following two queries will be for the hosts in the Phoenix DNS demo new VCN. As you can see, the last two queries are failing. Let's do the same test on the compute host in the Phoenix DNS demo new VCN. The results on this host are the same. Only the FQDNs in the same VCN are resolved. To apply the changes in this video scope, go to Hamburger menu, Networking, and Virtual Cloud Networks. Select the Phoenix DNS demo VCN. Click on the DNS resolver link. We must associate the Phoenix DNS demo VCN private view with Phoenix DNS demo new VCN private view. To do this, click manage private view, select Phoenix DNS demo new and save changes. Once the status becomes active, the changes needed for Phoenix DNS demo VCN are done. I am doing the same configuration for the Phoenix DNS demo new VCN. Once the status becomes active, I can return to the compute instances and redo the failed tests. After I associated the private views, everything should work as expected. And as you can see, the tests which failed earlier are now working. This concludes our demo. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you for watching.